Wow. I just watched these frickers just, just, they flew against the wind and they stood still and it kept them flying up there and then it pushed them back the other direction. Like it's, like it's a vortex or something going on up there. Like the wind's blowing in multiple directions. Like it blows one way and it blows in a different way. That was insane. Yeah, man, I'm watching this. The, the wind is funny up there, and it's messing with the way the birds are flying. And they're up there quite a ways. So maybe there's some kind of like, I think they're called thermal currents. Thermal currents means they're warm, so they're rising. And whenever this, this uh, phenomenon occurs, the birds kind of uh, go flying around because they get like free transportation. They ain't got to flap. All they got to do is just get up there, sit still, and the wind will take them places. Supposedly that's where the uh, uh, the legend of the Indian Thunderbird comes from. Is like because storm clouds have uh, geothermal currents, and big birds can use those currents to stay in flight without flapping their wings. So some people believe that they they came in on storm systems. Mm -hmm. They follow the currents of storm system. Hey, you remember E.G.?